Mary Magdalena, Miriam de Magdala her great love and her mission with Yeshua and Sarah in France. Our arrival in France was sponsored by Jose de Arimatea. Because of the great contacts and friends that Jose de Arimatea had, we settled in a castle. That's where Sarah grew up, surrounded by all the French nobility in the neighborhood. All this caused a great uproar in authorities, let's say it, from the time. By the descendants and origin of who they were, of who we were. They began to raise a great intrigue, through the changes that had reigned, we had to flee and take refuge in safe places. But there the seed was sown. There the lineage was sown. Everything they wanted to prevent, there was no way. We receive assistance and protection from the beloved knights of the temple. They assisted me and Sarah. They looked after, they looked after the grail, the blood. They looked after Sarah and her offspring. I went to take shelter in a safe place out of reach of them all. There I connected to an intraterrestrial city where I connected and encountered Yeshua in our subtle bodies. Yeshua and I always had a connection even though he was Legos we were always together. Our love was so big that there was no way or way they could pull us apart. Neither physics nor in the subtle planes. How many times did I not transport myself to where Yeshua was and Yeshua was where I was in our physical body and in the subtle planes, also connected to that great inner world that lay there, under that great cave. It was sublime moments the great love we lived. Because Yeshua and I, physically, were great lovers. Our love resulted in tenderness, caresses. It was something so sublime when we found each other that we always wanted to be together. They were unforgettable encounters always. And I want you to understand this. Because so much was said about me and still is said. Yeshua I fulfill missions everywhere we went, because we were anchoring points. Conditions turned out like this. Couldn't be Legos from Yeshua. Sometimes I cried of sadness and loneliness, but he felt me and came in his body where I was and my heart was overflowing with joy when I saw him. Physically we were such, a great couple. It was love and understanding always. Each one looking for the well-being of the other, the mission and our role that was corresponding to us. But always our heart and our love was united and is united forever. I really don't want to continue because, those moments sometimes make me a little sad. I want you to know that my great love, the love of my loves was Yeshua and is Yeshua. I am Mary Magdalene for you who knew me.